Welcome to the February 9th edition of Hounds Rewound, where we rewind the last week in the Sumpson Greyhound Athletics. This week, the men's ice hockey team split their two contests, falling to Stonehill before picking up a 4-3 win over Daniel Webster on a buzzer beater from senior Trevor Plant. Also in the Week 10 Ice Hockey Report, two Greyhounds picked up any 10 accolades as junior goalie Chris Hemhauser and freshman Cam Laughlin were named Goalie of the Week and Rookie of the Week respectively. The women's basketball team picked up a big conference win on the road at Bentley on Wednesday, topping the Falcons 73-61 before falling at home to Franklin Pierce on Saturday. Senior Caitlin Ackerman was named to the NE10 Weekly Honor Roll for averaging 18.5 points, 8.5 rebounds, and 4 steals while shooting over 57% from the field. The men's basketball team dropped two extremely competitive games this week to Bentley and Franklin Pierce, losing the games by a combined four points. Junior Terrence Bob Jones and sophomore Jack Sullivan were both named to the NE10 Weekly Honor Roll for their efforts. Bob Jones averaged 16.5 points, 6.5 rebounds, two assists, and two blocks, while Sullivan averaged 15.5 points, 6.5 rebounds, and shot over 50% from the field. The men's and women's track teams competed at the Dartmouth Invitational this past weekend. Senior Tony Fiermonte and freshman Derek Field led the Greyhounds with school record performances in the 3,000 and 500 meter races respectively. The women's side saw three school records of their own fall after impressive performances by freshman Antonia Pagliuca in the 3,000 meters, Kristen Leone in the 60 meter hurdles, and Megan Perrin in the high jump. Pagliuca was also named the NE10 Rookie of the Week for the third time this season. The women's swimming and diving team captured its second consecutive Northeast 10 championship this past weekend, claiming the victory by over 300 points. Freshman Neve Morgan was named Swimmer of the Meet as she was the only swimmer to capture three individual gold medals, setting three assumption records in the process. Overall, the team set 11 school records, two meet records, and captured 13 gold medals. Freshman Carrie Lynn Waite also performed exceptionally well on the weekend, tallying two individual gold medals while helping four relay squads to the top of the podium. Morgan was named NE10 Swimmer and Rookie of the Week for her performance, while the 400 freestyle relay team consisting of Waite, seniors Elise Prayson and Katha Medeiros, and junior Victoria Weber were named NE10 Relay Team of the Week for its record-breaking performance. And that wraps up this edition of Hounds Rewound. Tune in next week as we rewind another week of the 2014-15 season.